Good morning. Hello, hello, hello. It's Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal, and I am so glad that you are here with me this morning. Let's see who's here. Hey, Eddie slash Sherry Ballantyne, how are you? You know what? <laughs> Susan, you're right. It is it is afternoon now, isn't it? Oh my goodness, I'm still thinking it's morning, okay? Hey, Susan. Suzanne from Florida, how are you? Let's see who's there. We're going to be, uh, I'm going to show y'all a craft this morning. So, um, this is not going to be perfect, but guess what? We're not going for perfection. We're going to uh, enjoy the process. And I'm so glad that y'all are here to share this process with me. Hey, Lynn, I'm so glad you made it to my live. Guess who's here with me this morning? My wonderful husband is here. Yes, so, I am. <laughs> he'll be my cameraman this morning. So um, I just want to see who's here so I can just say good afternoon, not good morning. So the day has been going fast. I hope all of you enjoyed your, um, your Thanksgiving meals and, and all of that. So I've got a bunch of stuff going on here. And um, I want to read your comments on my computer as I get started. So we're going to be making a, a holiday decoration. And um, I'm hoping that y'all love this. So... Uh, so let's see, uh, Gay is here. Hey, Gay Pruitt from Illinois. Sarah is here from Maryland. Hey, Sarah, how are you? All of my crafty friends are here. I'm so excited. Eddie slash Sherry Valentine said, hey, Bill. <laughs> Hi there. Yeah, so um, I'm going to have Bill take over the camera, and I'm going to show y'all what we're doing here. We're going to go ahead and get started. So I've got um, some wire hangers here, or one wire hanger. I had to really hunt these down. Um, we're going to make like a hanging Christmas kind of decoration, Christmas tree decoration. And so I've made this before, but I never showed the process. And so I had to go and find my, some wire hangers. I think I only have two left in the closet, but if you have wire hangers, or you don't have one, get your friend to give you those wire hangers because we can make something out of those. I also uh, went to Dollar Tree and I got this um, really like a slender garland. It's 20 feet long, but I can use it for all kinds of decorations. I could use it to put in bows and things like that as well. Let's see what we got here. So this is a really thin garland. So I'm going to decorate this. I'm going to use this as decoration. Also, I do have some ribbon that I got from Goodwill. So look at that. This is going to be great. And um, this I've used before in other projects. And um, I think it was, I got three this same size of ribbon, wired edge ribbon. And I'm going to make a small, uh, a small bow for our decoration. And then I think I'm going to add these bells also. I should have opened these beforehand. But these were bells I got at the Dollar Tree. So this is um, not something that it's, is expensive to make. You know I always like to keep things budget friendly. Okay, so all I'm doing right now is I'm kind of having to restart my computer because I love seeing your comments. So Bill, if you could read some comments off there, see what's, what's going on. Well, they're kind of laughing about the fact you can't find wire hangers. Some people say they get the wire hangers of the cleaners. <laughs> a lot of people say they love the videos. Have your friends, some, your, some friend of yours has those wire hangers, okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm so glad y'all are loving the videos. I've been trying to do some Saturday morning stuff where I just come on, either chit chat or do a, a, um, some type of video. So what we're going to do is the wire hanger can be formed into the shape of a Christmas tree. And so this is probably one of the hardest things you have to do, basically, is trying to form this into a, a rectangular, actually, sorry, triangular shape to get a Christmas tree here. 
So we're trying to shape this into a rectangle and then we're gonna cover it with our garland. So if you see this, see how I'm doing this? It shouldn't be too, too hard to do. So I'm just kind of forming it until I get it exactly the way I want it. Hope y'all could see okay. How is the, um, y'all let me know how the uh, reception is on there and if y'all can hear me okay. I'm always concerned about that. Hopefully everyone has a good connection on here. Okay, Bill, what do you think about that? Does that look like a triangle? Yes, <laughs> it looks like it. How does that look, y'all? So I just pulled it apart basically and just started shaping it. Tracy Smith says, great reception. Okay, great. Lindsay says, you are her therapy. Oh, I'm so glad. Y'all are my therapy, too. Y'all don't understand. Janet says, yes, good. This is a good triangle right here. I'm trying to get the shape like a Christmas tree. So once you got the shape, you could just about start decorating it. The general consens consensus seems to be that reception is good. Okay, great. Eva Freeman is here. Hello, Fre Eva. Hey, Eva. How are you? I hope y'all had a wonderful uh, Thanksgiving with your families. Okay, so we got this done. This is going to be the hook where you're going to hang it from. So all I have to do is just kind of squeeze that in like that, and that'll be my hook. So I like to kind of play around with this a little bit and try to get this... Um, just get this shaped up. Okay, so we have anyone on with us right now, Bill? Yes. Uh, you got Michelle Williams from Florida, Eva. There's so many people you can't okay, even name. How many people are on with us? 93. Right oh, great. Yay. Linda Smith, Susan Baker, shape. Janet Buckman, Tracy Smith, Susan Baker, Lydia Hensley. I can't even, Dale hey, Morrow, there's so many. Oh, I'm so glad. You know, I was like, who's going to want to watch me do some live crafts and make a bunch of mistakes <laughs> on a Saturday morning, okay? After Black Friday. Um, so did any of y'all go out for Black Friday? That's the other thing I wanted to ask. Did anybody do anything for Black Friday? And did Friday? anyone get a TV? <laughs> Preferably 65 inches or above. Mm. Sounds like some wishful thinking there, okay. So I'm just kind of unraveling my garland. And if y'all see me stopping for a minute, I apologize. I'm trying to get my computer cranked up again. Creative Notion says, yes, she got a sharp 50, 4K, exactly. Oh no, Lord, don't get this man started on them TVs, okay. <laughs> okay, Tina so only got a 39. You That's can always okay. hang it in the bathroom. That's okay, Tina. Look, I don't need a big, big TV. I'm thinking of putting one in <clears> my craft room, but I think it'll be too distracting for me. I, I, I'm not sure. Something small, though. Then maybe Bill would come in the craft room with me. <laughs> uh, no. <sighs> okay, so I'm just kind of unraveling this. And this goes pretty fast. This is the garland from the Dollar Tree. And if you see this stuff, Please go ahead and grab it up, please. Because this stuff right here is awesome. Okay, Bill. So you got the shot on me? The last one. No, no it ain't. that's the no. one from yesterday. I got it. Okay, let's see what we can do. Don't forget. There it is. Okay, so I'm trying to watch y'all with the comments while I'm cranking <coughs> here. So let, just let, let, me, get, let, get, let, yeah. let me just go ahead and give that time to crank up. Okay, so we're just going to take this garland and we're going to wrap it around starting at the top here. Around starting at the top here. Okay, so I don't want to be echoing in here. Okay. <coughs> oh, look at Gay said husband bought huge speakers that we needed like a hole in the head. <laughs> exactly, <laughs> my man, that's how you do it. Ah. Hey Donna from Massachusetts, how are you? So we're gonna take our garland and all you're doing is, because this garland is wired, it can be shaped however you want. So the coolest thing is that I'm going to take my garland and just start wrapping it around and forming, you know what? A Christmas tree. <laughs> See how exciting I, excited I am about crafting? 
So all I'm doing is just taking this and wrapping it around. This is, of course, the top of my tree here. Yep. Camilla says she went to Hobby Lobby for craft materials to make a snowflake wreath. Oh, a snowflake wreath. Is it round? Is it a, uh, did you, what did you use as your base for that? I would like to know what you use as the base for snowflake wreath. Hey, Tamitha, there's my girl Tamitha. Hey, how you doing? Okay, so I'm just kind of wrapping this around. Wrapping this around. So you see how easy this is? I'm just forming a tree here. And nice thing is, if you want to make it wider, you can. I think this is a good size because I'm gonna, I know exactly where I want to hang this. And you could hang it on a door also. Kim says she used a, uh, what did she use? A round frame. You right, use the round frame? Okay. That's gonna be pretty. Um, Kim, if you have a chance, if you want, if you could take a picture, it would be nice to see that. I think a lot of people would be inspired by that. Um, and put a picture in my uh, Gift Basket Appeal Facebook page. I would appreciate that. I think people would like it. Okay, so I finished with one, right? And if you want it to be really full, you can do a second one of this on here. Rhonda Armstrong says, uh, I love your crafts, especially your gift baskets. Are you going to do any new gift basket design for this holiday season? Yes. Yes, I am. Yeah, I love doing gift baskets. So all I'm doing is continuing this. Just kind of doing a continuation of this. Just going to keep going. And you see how it's forming into a tree here, right? Because we want that to be nice and full. So does it look like a tree, y'all? <laughs> ah. Okay, so when I get close to the end, I'm going to kind of wrap this around because I'm going to pull it through underneath here because I want it to kind of be able to hang on and not slide off. Okay, so I'm just pulling it around and then through again, and I'm just going to continue wrapping that around. Just like that. Just pushing that up. They say yes. It looks All like right. a tree. There you go. That's good because if y'all told me it looked like something else, sometimes you have these ideas in your head and you're just not sure how they're going to look. Okay, so I'm just kind of wrapping this around here and making sure that it looks full. <clears throat> Now to end it, all I'm doing is wrapping it around itself, basically. And you could kind of smush it and get it. So I used about maybe two, two and three quarters of the garland here, maybe two and a half. It was a leftover piece of garland. And so this is what we have so far. Now what I'm going to do is, uh, let's see, maybe I'll make my bow. Or I can start wrapping this with this. What you think, Bill? I'll let you decide. Bow next, or am I gonna use this? Don't know. <laughs> Tamitha says, are you loving this tutorial? Then give it a thumbs up and click on the bell icon to get notifications for all the live shows. Yeah. Thank you, Tamitha. Thank you, Tamitha. Tamitha is awesome, okay? Tamitha is awesome, and she works for May May Made It, and when I tell you such a wonderful person, Tamitha is on it, okay? Susan Baker said, yes, she is. Okay, so I'm going to take the gold now, and I am just going to tie everything to the top, and it doesn't matter if you tie it around this little thing here because I'm going to have uh, some ribbon at the top. I'm going to have a bow at the top, so I'm just going to tie this and then I'm going to kind of just wrap it around just like you would do if you were decorating your Christmas tree. 
So you see how that goes now? Yeah, do that first. After the, after the fact of the matter. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> ah, look at that. It's just going at an angle, just like you would do the Christmas tree. I'm really loving these lives on Saturday. I hope y'all are enjoying them too. Don Brady says, I wish there was a Dollar Tree where I live. Oh, Don, where are you? Don, where do you live? Okay, so right here. Let's see, I could adjust this, Bill. How do you think it looks, babe? It's looking good. There you go. It's, she it's says Scotland. Oh, wow. Yeah, um, I think, th is it the pound store that y'all have there? I think I hear a lot of people talking about the pound store. Uh, Miss Pearl says some pearl trim would be pretty cute. <gasps> Don't tell me that. Don't, t look y'all, that would be cute, okay? Pearl trim, that's a good, look, y'all gonna have to make, make me have to make another one, huh? <laughs> okay, so this is what it looks like so far. Yeah, Tracy Smith says, yes, Dawn, try Poundland. They sell uh, similar items. Thanks, Tamitha. I'm loving this. Okay, so look how easy this is. Who's going to say, ooh, is that a wire hanger under there? No one, okay, <laughs> unless you tell them. Kim Ellis says, how do I send a picture? Um, it's on Facebook, right? Yeah, on, through Facebook. If you go to my Gift Basket Appeal Facebook page, you'll see where it'll say... Um, add a picture or photo rather and you can add it like that now look this I thought these were individual <laughs> I thought these were individual ornaments and they're not they're actually a string of um, they're actually a string of bells so I don't know let's see uh, see what happens when you don't open the package first <laughs> What do you think, babe? Let's see how we could get these on here. Yeah. I'm, you I'm really... Well, you can have them come from the top, like, like you just did. Come down to the side, and then through the bottom, like that. Like that? <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey. Look, I was tending on cutting individual pieces of this. <laughs> Brenda says, I love the tutorials. I use a lot of your ideas in my craft groups at my assisted living facility. Oh, I can't yes. wait to try this one with them as it seems quite simple. It's Blessings. very simple and you can do put anything on it. I think this would go really good. I think <clears> they would love it. So what I'm going to do is um, <laughs> I'm going to cut these, okay? Because... Um, yeah, Lynn, I had to put my two cents in, you know? <laughs> oh boy, look, look. This is not going to You see work. why I stay out of the craft room, <laughs> don't you? Ah, okay, so let's let's go ahead and see what we, <laughs> Let's see what we can do with these, okay? I feel like cutting them apart would be a good thing, but um it seems like if you cut them apart, they start falling apart. Right, so now you're back to my idea, which is what? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> ah, let's see. <laughs> I know Lydia, he's a hoot, isn't he? He wakes up laughing. <laughs> okay, so cut and string them right here, right? Cut and string. Yeah, you know what? Put one here. That way I can. And can't. one here. Okay, that way. Look at y'all helping with the crafting. Hey, I did something. Hubby crafting. Look, I'm going to have him do a live and have him do the whole crafting. No, thing. I'm going to do that gift basket. He wants to do a gift basket. He's been asking me to do that for a while. I'm just, you know. <laughs> I have to show my skills, okay? <laughs> He's got skills. So let's see if I tie this on. I don't have enough to tie that on with. See, I was trying to stay Tamitha away from says, my- Tamitha says hot glue them back together. I was trying, that's what I'm, I'm gonna have to do that. Um, my glue gun is all the way up. See, even Lynn agrees that I have good ideas. He has good ideas. Thank you, Lynn. He really does. Sometimes You're quite insightful, Lynn. I like the way you think. <laughs> ah. I don't know if y'all saw the video with me and Bill and my mom at Ollie's, but it was just an absolute 
It was so funny, and it was also a disaster. Yes, Doreen. Doreen says, let them hang on the bottom of the tree. Hmm. Oh, just on the bottom? Well, you know, think about it for a second. I mean, it, the thing is going to be hanging up, so they're going to see the bottom of it. It's, gonna, it's not going to be laying on a flat surface, right? I think it? I can hang some of them from the bottom. Yeah, it's going to be hanging up. So I'm, like, struggling with this little thing right here. So I may have to end up just putting some here. Yeah, because it's going to be hanging here. suspended. I think I might have to get my glue gun. I was trying to not have a glue gun involved you want in this. Let me go get it. But uh, <laughs> it looks like we're going to have to do a glue gun. Someone, Tracy says, had, the video had her in tears of laughter. Tamitha says, your mom is so adorable. Oh, my goodness. Isn't she just adorable? She was over here for Thanksgiving. Oh, well, you can keep up with her. She keeps getting lost. <laughs> okay? Yeah, we lost mom in Ollie's. Y'all only saw one losing, okay? During a live. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I think maybe there, right? So it's coming together. If Usually, when Tracy's mother gets lost, I just listen for the sound because she has one of those kind of personalities. I, it wouldn't be uncommon to find her with a group of employees having the same Christmas carols or something. <laughs> She's one of those types, believe me. Ah. Hold it, so I'm gonna get the glue gun. Okay, so Bill is gonna go get the glue gun. Let me see what y'all are saying while he goes and get the. Tamitha, you know what? That's a good idea. Tamitha says we can use the twist ties, Bill, to get them on yeah. there initially. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I needed to get, I didn't realize that these bells uh, were like a garland type bell. So I just, um, I picked them up, opened them up this morning, and lo and behold, <laughs> I have twist ties in the basket upstairs. My husband doesn't know where anything is in the craft room. He's like, which basket? You got about 17 baskets. <laughs> ah. The basket that when you first come in the door, it's on the, <laughs> it's on the left. It's on the right, rather. We're on the table? Huh? No, not on the table. <laughs> the one on the ground. The basket that's on the ground. You, you'll see all of the little um, chenille stems slash, yeah. And you got the glue gun too? Yes. Okay. <laughs> this is how wonderful it is when you're doing live videos. I think the wonderful thing is, is that you can do the lives. And if, if, if you don't want everything to be perfect, then live, live video is great. Yeah. Yes, Michelle, my mom does have a bubbly personality. I agree. And she's always been like that. But it, 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 you got to get up and do it. You ain't gonna reach all the way. red pipe cleaners would be good. I think it'd be good, babe. Yeah, that's fine. You could move it over there. Um, put something under it so you don't burn up the table. <laughs> ah, Tabitha, I know Bill is a is is a hoot. Put something underneath there, Bill, so you don't burn it up. Like what? We don't have new things. Something. Do a metal anymore. cap. But my husband turns on the glue gun, right? And has it on the table, so he's gonna he's gonna burn up my um. Look, this is what hubby does. He plugs in the, the glue gun <laughs> and leaves it to drip on the table, okay? He's like, uh, oh, uh, do we need to do that? Look, and he wants to make a basket. <laughs> Where Ollie's store is, actually, we have one here in Mableton, Georgia. But if you go on their website and put in your... Um, if you put in, if you put in your zip code, you should be able to find an Ollie store. Just, just put one of those containers right there. A little container for it to drip into. Right Anything, in. something with glass. Yeah. Okay, here. Hold this. I'll get it. Yeah. Hey, Miss Superclutch, how are you? Miss Superclutch, how you doing? All right, I'm at the helm now while Tracy hunts down some stuff. So how you guys doing? Did y'all eat as much as I did yesterday? If you did, I know you picked up at least 10 pounds. <laughs> okay. 
All righty. So we are cooking with fire. All right, Tracy's back at the helm. Oh, no, here you go. Go. Oh, that's all right. I can't. Okay, so we over here struggling, okay? <laughs> okay, so we're back in. Deb says, is this a Dollar Tree DIY? Yes, it is. All Dollar Tree stuff. The only thing that wasn't Dollar Tree is this. I'm going to make a bow from this. So if you just tuned in, I am making a tr Christmas tree decoration using a wire, uh, a wire hanger. Okay. The Super so. Club says she walked her meal off Friday. Uh, was at the mall from 4 a.m. to 2:15 p.m. Let's see. I. Super Club's got a TV, a 70 inch. Uh oh. Go no, I'm just kidding. Plus? I just said that. Oh. <laughs> Look, that's built with the wishful thinking. There's no other reason to walk that long unless you came out with a 70. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to take this twist tie and see if this works. Okay. I'm just kind of twisting it along here. Y'all are seeing this in real time. And we are going to see if this will actually hang on here. I'm just looping it around here through the back where you can't see it. Creative Notion says I can use this idea for decorating door contests at work. Yes, you can. You sure can. I've actually used this and just used without the hanger and I've made a Christmas tree kind of go spiraling down on a window. And then I decorate it from there. I just taped it right onto the window. Okay, so. Well, there you go. We got this on here, Bill. Look. Okay. That's the first bell. Okay, so let's see. So I'm using the little twist ties. I'm just taking them and like cutting them. And then I'm just twisting it around to give a little bit of an extension on here. And just wrapping them around here. You know how we crafters do. We come and figure out ways to do stuff. You know, we invent stuff. That's the nice thing about crafting. Is Apparently. This, there's no one way to do it. So, um... Uh, Monica says she's going to make one for a sewing room. Tell Bill he needs one for a sewing room. I don't have a sewing room. That's Mark, my brother-in-law. <laughs> I have a, a, a music room. That's what I have outside. Yeah, this is my music man, okay? He has a, his, the garage is his music producing studio, I exactly. guess you could say that. Yeah. Rosanna says you can use a melting pot to catch drips. That way you can remelt the glue. Oh, nice. Laura says she missed doing it. She used to do it at the nursing homes, but the state won't allow them to do it anymore. The state ought to be shaming himself. Try to jump in and stop progress and happiness. Mm. Linda, is your husband from Saginaw, Michigan? Yes, I am. The, Linda, please tell me you're not from Saginaw. Bill, there's nothing wrong with Saginaw. Oh, <laughs> man. She says, we love you guys here. My daughters and I watch you. Oh, Linda, you from sweet. Saginaw? Sweet. That's where I am, Linda. I'm from there. I, actually, I, I'm from Buena Vista. Penny, don't you, Penny? Oh, yes. You know, look, he needs to sing. Because guess what? It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Sing, girl. Everywhere you go. He's the singer, though. <laughs> no, I'm not the singer. <laughs> he really is. Bill, just give I'm us something. While, while I figure this out, okay? <laughs> Look, that doesn't look bad at all. Well, there you go. And I'm going to go back and neaten it up a little bit because I know how I am. So look, just to get you, give you all a shot Teresa of what says, I've got. I need two of these for my glass French doors. It'd be Ooh, so cute. Oh, that would be cute. So this is what the back looks like. So it's pretty neat. Well, there you go. Yep, not too bad. And this is what the front looks Ms. like. Ms. Superclus says, what do you mean, girl? Not bad at all. It's gorgeous. Oh. Thank you. Joan, you are too, too much. Okay. Yes, Miss Superclutz. She is such a Joyce. sweetheart. Joyce. Brenda, where can I purchase one? Joyce. Yeah, Joyce, go ahead. Bill needs to say. Um, Bill, sing that Wish You a Merry Kumbaya, Christmas. Kumbaya. Kumbaya. That's not good enough right there, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Kumbaya, kumbaya, ha, ha, 
Good enough. Yep. Oh my god. Look. <laughs> Lady S scraps <laughs> crafts. You said uh oh take us to church, right? Oh, thank you, Tamitha. I appreciate that. I'm trying to be uh I'm trying to be crafty this morning or this afternoon, I should say. See, I think it's still morning. Me and Bill binge watched some movies Suzanne, yesterday. Suzanne, that's pretty funny. Where is my channel? I've been touring around with creating one for so long. The problem is I end up doing so many projects with different people that I, I don't seem to have time. Well, I don't make time is what Tracy would say. Uh, let's not go there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now we got this going on. Uh, yeah, uh, Brenda, I'm with you. Rosanna, when can we uh, purchase a melting pot? That's a good idea. How about old Christmas tree? Where did you meet? Who? Me and Tracy? Yeah. We met online. No, the other channel, okay? <laughs> yes. We actually met online and I tried to scare this man away. Which okay? is quite an impossibility. And, and I as, might you, add. as you see, it didn't work, okay? <laughs> okay, so this is what we have so far. How, how do y'all, what do y'all think? I'm, th I'm kind of loving it. I think I can kind of adjust a few things just to make it a little bit more. Um, I like the, the two rows. Coming. I got the bow coming to the top. Oh, Linda said we're a match made in heaven. Thank you so much. He, he's an awesome, awesome person. Oh, Linda says she met her husband online too, 16 years ago. Really? I met Bill. Huh? This has it's been, been a like long time. 12, 13, 14 years now. That online thing is incredible. I tried to scare him away. Y'all don't understand. I invited him to my church. Right? She can't scare me away. I was away. like, I'm going to scare him away. I'm going to, I'm going to, um. When I first him. looked at her, I just said, I, I do. <laughs> okay? She's like, but you don't even know me. I said, well, what would you like to tell me? Okay? It's a done deal here. Oh, Miss Superclutch met her husband at a bowling alley. Well, there uh, you go. 41 years ago. Oh, my goodness. Awesome. 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 So did Rosanna, Rosanna must have asked the question, where can we find the melting pot? Let's see if I can find, uh, I missed it. I, I missed it. Okay. You <laughs> better repeat it. the question, Rosanna. <laughs> Linda's laughing at something. <laughs> Tamitha met her husband 27 years ago at college. Oh, wow. So Tamitha, he laid his hooks on you and that was it. He said, that's it. You belong to me. <laughs> Tamitha, don't, don't get this man started. Your okay? search is over, Tamitha. <laughs> I'm here now. That's what he said. <sighs> Oh, Glenda is here. From the Netherlands. Oh, wow. Lynn, you said to use a small crock pot. Oh, that's a good idea. Bill, I need a small crock pot. Dang, Deb just celebrated 23 years, and she's only 43. Oh, wow. How old were you, you could... met? Nine? Just kidding. <laughs> that was love right there. Uh, okay, so I'm going to make a little mini bow. And this is somewhat of a wired ribbon but it's silky also. So all I'm doing is I'm just gonna make a tiny bow to fit on the top of the tree. And I don't want it to be too big and too overwhelming. So I'm just kind of matching it up. I'm just eyeballing it here. Okay, Rosanna said Michael's. You can find um, the melting pot uh, thingy at Michael's. Okay, great, great. Okay, so I'm gonna make my little bow. Thank y'all so much, y'all are so helpful. Suzette says she's been married for 32 years. They met at a party. Nice. Who made the first move, him or you? He did. He That's did, how it yeah. Works, okay? I was, I was kind of scared of the online thing. My, um, yeah, I was scared of the online thing. I was like, this man could be some kind of a stalker. <laughs> murderer. I was a stalker. Okay? <laughs> Come on, could be. Or something. And I was just like, my friend signed me up. Let me for tell you something. Service. When I first saw Tracy's picture, I took a screenshot and put it on my computer before I even met her. I said, this is it. See, and he never told me that. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have ran. <laughs> <laughs> I said, this is the one. I would have right been block, delete, everything. Ooh, okay. Look at this one. That's what I said. Oh, she was from Barbados, babe. Dale said she met her husband through her best friend. They didn't even like each other. It took them eight years. 
before they got married. Uh. In 23 years, they've been married last week. Oh. Janice been married six years. So, Bill, how do you think the bow looks? Another loop on this or no? Oh, uh, you're the pro. Probably another one, just for the heck of it. If you have to ask, that means throw one more loop. Like I know something. I should have okay. Bill. You should know how to make a bow by now, baby. No, I don't, I, do, I don't know how to do that. All the both both he edits all the videos, so I'm sure that yes, I do that. Since he watches all of this, he should know how to do now each that part and every is craft. True. He should know how to do each and every craft here. No, only the ones that I don't know. I like these mini. I can't do that. I really like these mini bows. I don't have the patience to mess around with, with bows. <laughs> I can do bigger stuff. You know what uh, I mean? Okay, so we are stringing along here. And we're actually uh, doing this live with my phone. So Man, Miss Superclutch, they've been married 41 years. And uh, they only dated for four months before they got married. Oh, my goodness. He just said, look. Yeah, when it's your soulmate. Woman? That's your soulmate, you know. Okay, so I'm just kind of fluffing these up a little bit. What he told her, he said, look, either you're going to get married or I'm going to have to kidnap you. Take your pick. Okay. <laughs> don't y'all don't get this <laughs> man started, okay? <laughs> it's gonna be one of them, okay? Uh, Laura. Laura says my hubby and I met at work nine years he ago. He thought I was lost when I was waiting by the time clock. <laughs> no, 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 Laura. Let me tell you, he knew you weren't lost. That was his line. That was his end. He was determined to get over there. Okay, that's how guys think. <laughs> Let me tell you something. The guys are standing in front of a McDonald's and, and see a woman and say, excuse me, miss, could you tell me where I can find the McDonald's? <laughs> and then the woman says, uh, it's right there. Then the guy go, oh, I'm so embarrassed. Oh, my God. I'm so embarrassed. Please have lunch with me so I can get over my embarrassment. Of, you know. <laughs> In that case, you better wait in front of like uh, something a little bit more wait upscale. Inside of, wait okay. inside of the other, other Mercedes upscale. dealership. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, I think okay. I stick with the McDonald's, okay? <laughs> Lydia, is, <laughs> Lydia is dying, okay? Uh, okay, so now... <laughs> Dang, Linda, that's my type of guy. He asked to marry on the first date. Wow. Ooh, Linda, I'm scared of you. <laughs> Linda say, that's can how we, I roll, okay? Can we finish this now, babe? Okay, go ahead. <laughs> So now we're going to attach our bow. <laughs> That's that second on, okay? We're going to attach our bow on the top here, okay? <laughs> and so I'm just, all I'm doing is taking my uh, same chenille stem. Bill, show them the top part. Okay. Yeah, right there. See, Bill, Bill's all off camera, okay? <laughs> this part right here. And just kind of wind it around. All I'm doing is winding it around to attach, attach it. And I'm maybe... talking so much, I forgot we was doing the craft. Okay? <laughs> now now y'all see why, okay? <laughs> oh, I'm glad you like the bow. Okay, so, and you don't have to, I saw like there's some nice ornaments. You can take that if you want to just kind of hot glue it to the top. I saw some cute star ornaments at Dollar Tree. So you don't have to do a bow if you don't want to. And, um, and so there's... There's what I have right now. And then if I wanted to, I can take one of these. That red um, is nice. It really brings out the, the red bell things mm -hmm. right here. But look, babe, I could take a bell and put it in the middle there. Oh, yeah, do that. Have do that. Do the green one. The green one. Have it dang. No, put it red in the middle. Right there. Oh, where's my top? <laughs> I don't know. Now I need the... Uh, glue gun for this. So you think I should just glue Deb it Deb right says on? the bow is everything. The bow really does tie it, it together. It really ties it. And I wasn't sure what <clears> bow <throat> to use. I was going I have some other bows that I was going to use and I said, you know what? I have this already. Do you ever go to the craft store and you buy something and it's like, I already have this right here in my craft room. And I went and bought this bow because I said I could use this for something else. And then I went and got this. This right here, if y'all... If y'all see this, I'm going to show you this real quick. At Dollar Tree, this right here is everything. I can cover this with something. This is a burlap with Christmas decorated on top, like stamped right on top of it. This is so, so cute. It's not wired. It's just a regular burlap, but this would be pretty. Um, even if you're doing some wreaths, 
I think this will make a, a great bow. So just, just to show y'all that, but they had a bunch of these at Dollar Tree and I had never seen it. I ran in there to get just one thing and came out with more uh, ribbons. Which is pretty much how the norm. You know, Bill. <laughs> okay, just show this. <laughs> Stay focused there, okay? <clears throat> Okay, so, um, uh, let's see, when well, I'm trying to bend over here because, um, She says that'd be a good background, uh, uh Tamitha says this, that'd be a good background for a card. Oh, that would, wouldn't it? Tamitha, all these ideas, you know. <laughs> it just takes one idea, and then the next thing you know. Okay, so, I'm just gonna put some hot glue in the middle of this. My husband has the glue gun plugged all the way over on the other side of the table. Well, hey. And I can't even reach it. Okay. You gotta get up. No, I'm just gonna go do this right here. I'm just putting some hot glue in the center of my uh, ribbon. And I'm so out of my element because I'm not in my craft room. My craft room space is my space. Let's see. Oh, that hangs on real good there. Yeah, I, I, I plugged it in the right place. See? Okay, so, so Bill actually came up with something. a wonderful he has some great ideas i have to admit he has some great ideas and then you can just go back and adjust this and uh i hope this inspired you though um to give you some ideas and you could go ahead and put some um chenille stems on here if you want to get this tighter up in there uh but i just wanted to kind of share this with you and kind of inspire you just to kind of get the creative energy flowing hopefully y'all are making some stuff I don't know if it's too early for Christmas, but I've been working on my tree. It's um, Inga. Hi, Inga. Hey. I said her name wrong last time. Oh, you know what? Suzette said she would put lights on it, too. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Let's see. Uh, oh, Lydia, I'm glad you like it. Never too early. You're right. It's never too early to start decorating, which is why I have my tree up. I had my I started decorating my tree about a week ago, so I'm still adding stuff to it. Oh, you said okay, Bill. You sing. You light up my life. <laughs> you remember that song? No. You don't remember? You light up my life. No. This man knows so many songs. Okay. You could wrap the burlap ribbon. Um, around one of the Dollar Tree square vase, oh, glass vote. You know what? I was thinking about that or even wrapping it around a can and then adding some silk flowers with this, uh, this burlap ribbon. That's a good idea. That is a good idea. Go Dell, yeah. <laughs> uh, hello from Washington, DC. How are you? Oh, he got the whole world in his hand, Bill. That's what she's saying. Saying that so we can uh, get now ready to We have to, to get off. this tree right quick. We're doing the tree. We got the whole, We're focusing. Um, he got the whole world. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. <laughs> Just the two first two lines. Hey, y'all, I hear cricket. <laughs> Look, Bill got something. Look, Bill. <laughs> Bill got something to say. Now all of a sudden, <laughs> I hear crickets. Okay. <laughs> 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 Never too early. I have been helping my brother and sister-in-law uh, put up some Christmas lights. Blue, nice. forever blue. Says oh, yes, hello from Trinidad and Tobago. Yeah, sing one of your uh, Stevie Wonder songs. He loves Stevie no, Wonder. No, this is good. Just the first, the two first two bars. First song. Oh yeah, go ahead. I didn't know one. Ribbon in the sky. That's your favorite one. <laughs> Okay, we're hearing crickets again. So uh, <laughs> anyway, we're going to go ahead and um, sign off. I hope you all like this idea. I hope this really helped you um, and inspired you just to do something. And it doesn't have to be something that's, that's super difficult to make. It's su you can do something with just about anything. And I bet you some of you have this Ooh, around Mount the Pleasant house. Ooh, in the house. I bet some of you have some of this stuff in the house. You know, just somewhere. Uh, just get some stuff together. Have fun. 
And um, I appreciate each and every one of you. Mm -hmm. Thanks so much for following us here. And I will see you real soon. Bye. Bye. Here you go. Oh, hit finish, huh?